Yeah. <laughs> 45 defending. That's shocking. <laughs> All right, lad. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hello, Musala. You're not shy. No, I'm not shy. <laughs> hey. <laughs> so you both from Liverpool? No, no. I'm from Liverpool. I'm from Manchester. You're from Manchester? Yeah. Which team you support? United. Which team you support? Everton. <laughs> what I'm doing here? <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I can see that. <laughs> Very comfortable. I'm a striker just like you, but a bit better. <laughs> I would be happy for you. I'm going to say a scouse word, you repeat it after me. Scran. Scran. That's food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you should say food next time. <laughs> and then jog. Jog? Jogging? Um, no, like jog. Um, it means not very good. Why are you making it difficult? You can just say not very good. Jog. Do you want to keep the book? Yeah, please, please. <laughs> so now I have to improve my English and improve another language here. My mum would describe me um, as smiley and chatty. What would your mum describe you as? <laughs> I, I, I also smile a lot. She described me as a polite man. She doesn't know what is behind, but she described me as a polite man. <laughs> I've heard that you like cats. My daughter loves cats, so I get two. Boss and Scrub. I didn't decide the names, to be honest. It's my daughter, <laughs> she decided the names, so I had nothing to say. I've got you a present. Do you want to read that out? Meow, meow, Sarah. Running down the wing. <laughs> That's a nice one. The relationship now is perfect, so I see any cat in the street. Come, come, come. <laughs> <laughs> Can you stand up now, please? I can. Can you um, put your hands on your hips, please? Yeah. Can you face me, please? Can you follow me? Megs! No way! <laughs> We've got your FIFA card here. We're just going to talk to you about it. So, shooting 86. It's, it's, it's OK. 45 defending. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't defend. That's shocking. No, don't be shocking. That's if you watch our game. <laughs> 81 passing. That's bad. Yeah. I'm telling you the truth. That's not the best. And what do you think of 74 physical? I should get like... Maybe you have to go to the gym, get those guns working. And they'll probably have a skill named after you called the most seller. So you do it like this? <laughs> is your hair always like that in, in the morning when you wake up? It's better than now, to be honest, but I don't know what is going on last few weeks. When I wake up, it was like, like a little bit here, going down. And I sleep like that. So my hair from here, it's like sleeping, sleeping, uh, sticking, sticking. Then I had to just, that's fine now. My parents really annoy me. What's the three things that annoy you the most? I think if someone sitting with me and he's talking a lot, <laughs> Lovren, don't ask. Lovren is the one I'm talking about. <laughs> Before you ask, I'm talking about Lovren. Do you know your daughter? I know her. Yeah, I know her. Um, <laughs> would you like her to be like you? She can do whatever she wants to be. She wants today to be singer, but last week she wants to be dancer. One day she will find the best for her. Girls are the best, aren't we? <laughs> Yeah, I have to say yes. <laughs> when your daughter was on the pitch and scored the goals, are you happy that she got more cheers than you when you scored? <laughs> I'm happy that she enjoyed the moment. She felt the love from the fans. And she like she went home and she told me like that I want to go tomorrow to the game again to score a goal. I said, it's not every day we get a goal input, so <laughs> just like <laughs> Each year, maybe, but not every day. <laughs> if your daughter wants a, a kickabout any day when she's a bit older, can she come to our training one day? 
Yeah, but probably she will play for Liverpool if I stay for a long yeah. time. Of course. <laughs> and I will teach her just to play in my position <laughs> and score. Yeah. Yeah. Of course, if I stay here for a long time, of course she will play for, for Liverpool. Yeah. I really enjoy playing for Liverpool. What's your favourite thing about playing for Liverpool? Oh, everything. Since I'm, jo I'm, I'm joining the team and you can see the fans, you can see the atmosphere in Anfield and you can see how the people love the team and the city loves the team. It's something something huge, like makes you really love the team and love the city and love the people, how they, they treat me. Yeah, there's a lot of things I can say. What's the best and worst thing about being Mo Salah? <laughs> the worst thing I can say, like, you don't have like privacy anymore. But it's fine, I'm not complaining, but I'm just saying that the worst part. But the good thing, I think, I'm happy about what I have and uh, where I am now. So, yeah, I think the, the rest is fine. What's it like to live in your dream? When I sit with myself and I feel, I see where I am, and I think about when I was young and uh, I love to play football, I love to, to play for Liverpool. It's something really, really makes me happy. I'm really enjoying the moment. I'm enjoying where I am, enjoying every single thing happened to my life. So it's great. Before a match, my dad tells me to try my best. What um, advice do you have? Always have clear goal in your mind. Do your best. Every time you go out from the, the game or from the field, you just feel happy about yourself. Even if you didn't score, you just feel like you did everything you could do. Helping the team to win the games, that makes you feel good Thank about you. yourself. No problem. Who from the staff told you to complain about my shooting? No one. No one? Did you watch Liverpool games? Yeah. Oh, okay. So you see my goals. Okay, perfect. Hello. <laughs> uh, can we talk to you here? Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Subscribe to the channel now. 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 <laughs>